Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the Infinite Vision platform. Right now I'll be doing one such question that came in your J main examination. This question came on 1st September 2021 and this question came on second shift. So let us see this question first. Question says an object of mass small m is being moved with a constant velocity. Okay, under the action of a applied force of 2 Newton along a frictionless surface with following surface profile. So this is the setup which has been given to you. The correct applied force versus the distance graph you need to choose is. So which one is the correct graph of force and displacement? So we already know that uh, force and distance, not displacement. Okay. So we so this much of setup has been given to you. This block of small m is pulled with the force of 2 newton so and it is moving with a constant speed so that means this mg sin theta component of the weight must be equal to 2 newton because the net force acting on this small object must be equal to 0 so then only it will move with a constant speed and this up if upward direction is taken to be positive so so along this half portion of the distance this much portion of the distance this uh, external force which is acting on it which is balancing its uh, weight component mg sin theta must be constant for this much of distance this force component must be constant so that means which option and it is positive also because it is there along the direction of motion of along the direction of motion of small f um, object because this small object is moving in the upward direction so this is the direction which I have taken which we have taken as positive so if it is going like this so that means this force is constant and it is positive so you are left with only one option to choose from again while it is coming downward again it has to move with a constant velocity for which this component mg sin theta is acting downward now this force has to be applied in the form in the backward direction why is it so then only the net force would be zero then only it will move with a constant speed let it be v okay because here also it was moving with a constant speed of v so while coming downward this force has to be applied in the backward directions then only the, it will be balancing mg sin theta now rest everything is clear because this force is in backward direction so this has to be negative as long as it is coming down so for rest half of the portion this force which has to be acting on the object and it has to be negative so and it is also constant so the second is the only option that we are getting and second would be the correct option I hope this question is clear to everyone thank you